Yo, what's going on guys, it's Posse, and today I'm bringing you another butt video, yes, week two, episode two, Road to the Super Bowl, and I'm going to show you some some packs I opened, I didn't open all of them from last uh, episode, I opened some, you know, points, or whatever, Madden points, maybe, Mutt points, I guess, since, you know, FIFA does FIFA points, but I mean, yeah, I, I just, you know, I got the promo pack and all that stuff, so I, pretty much the usual stuff that you get in a, you know, pack when you start, you get draft pack and all that stuff, so, this is the stuff that I'm getting, and also I did a little bit of a, you know, a pack opening, I bought, uh, you know, I think another PSN card, you know, all that stuff, because I, to me, when I play Madden, I, you know, I put my money, and, uh, you know, the money that I put in the points and I spend them coin games or that and and you know buying coins and I don't think Madden does I mean we can buy coins to get players I don't think they do that like what FIFA does or you you know you spend a hundred dollars you get a million coins I don't think that I don't think you can do that but I mean yeah just like you know people buy all these co players and it's like damn bro what's the point of even playing like of you know buying all these Mutt coins and all that stuff, a hundred dollars worth of you know Madden coins, and sometimes it's just ridiculous. I don't know. That's just a different story, and I really don't really care. But sometimes when they just—that's uh, literally—that's literally about FIFA. FIFA's always done that. But I mean, this is Madden. This is why I like Madden because the players are not overrated. They're not stacked. You, if you literally legit have an 80 overall card. Even a 75 year overall card, it's a decent card. But I just see right here, we're gonna go to week two and hopefully get another W. Hopefully, I would love to have a season undefeated. I never, <laughs> I never had in Madden online had a winning record. It's always been low. So hopefully, this <laughs> this Madden's a brand new year, new year, new me. But right off the bat, Manziel throws it to his eligible lineman. What the hell? But as you see, the next play, we're like, nah, we ain't having that, son. So second and 21, Menzel dropping back, looking for a man, and he sees him and tries to get some, you know, some extra yards, but that's, you know, he goes back to third and 10, so hopefully he can, we can stop him right here, but my bad usering <laughs> least gets him to, uh, you know, stop him for it down, but you know when people play man, and they're going to go for it, but when you go for it, you get stuffed. See, I learned my lesson last week that, you know, hey, Going fourth down, you're going to, you know, ain't going to happen. But we see right here, we get the new pickup, Andre Ellington, the Clemson boy. So happy that we picked him up. He is a good, he is a good card to pick up. But you see right here, try to run the screen, and it gets automatically shut down. So I'm just trying to, you know, as usual, pound, 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 pound the rock. And at this time, I was getting a little nervous, you know. I was like, I, maybe I need to start passing the ball a little bit because it, you eventually it will get picked up and it won't be able to stop. But I tried to throw the deep ball to the two. The rookie Mike Evans, but that was a no-go. So we have pretty much a stalemate of a game right now. We really legit pound on the rock. He's passing, trying to do all these, you know, these, you know, these plays right now. We're we're literally stopping each other. It's been it's really a good game. I see right here he goes on a, again fourth and six, and he gets it with his lineman again. What the hell? This big ass dude already bumbling, stumbling already. You see Manzel breaking a tackle and getting there the first down. I don't think he broke a tackle. I think he just scrambled, but nonetheless, he got the first down. We see Manzel dropping back again. Fires gets his running back and gets the first down. See, so now I'm thinking, all right, bro, calm down. Maybe throw a little bit of heat again. Try to get him, you know, nervous. Get a little startled up because this man's working on the drive to at least get some points to end the first half and hopefully, you know, maybe a field goal just so he can just get some points on the board. You know, hopefully, you know, I can point some points as well. But he throws a quick pass and breaks a tackle. And that was a pretty good pass. Throws it on the money. This man is working up a drive. So all we had to do was just get a pick. And you see Manziel running. He's looking for a man. He fires and he gets almost picked off. I see Manziel just frustrated because that would have been a perfect drive on that note. You see Manziel firing. Look, and he gets hit on the play. Now we gotta put some, we gotta put some, you know, some blitzes in there. Hopefully, because this man's getting startled. And look at this guy! Finally, somebody listens. But <laughs> this is my dumbass part. I try to call timeout to maybe freeze him up a little bit, but you know that really doesn't work. 
well, when I first played Madden, I had no clue how to call a timeout, so I hit the option or the share button because I'm used to Xbox or PS3 where you just hit, you know, select, call timeout, boom, right there. But I completely, you know, I almost panicked. I thought I'd turn off the system. I, I panicked. I, I screamed like a little, like a little baby, you know, bitch. But <laughs> that was it's a different story. But as you see right here, I'm now I'm starting to move the ball a little bit with Andre Ellington, making it look good, showing all these clumsy boys right here. And you see Peyton Ellis. Oh my God. Um, I forgot to tell you about last week. Um, Peyton fumbles a little bit, not too much. But the man will fumble the ball and could cost you a game. So just be on the lookout next time if that does happen when you do pick up a Peyton Hillis and you want to use him. Watch my video and see what happens. But, I mean, nonetheless, this man can run. As you see, Manziel gets destroyed right there. So we're third and 20. I mean, I'm just, just going to try to throw the rock. As you see right here, we try to. And it almost happens, but it doesn't. So... What do you do? You take your points, and hopefully we can kick this beautiful long boot, and it... Ugh, bruh. Like, come on, man. Couldn't get nothing on that. Couldn't get no leg. But, uh, I mean, yeah, so it, this, is, this has been a really good game. When the games come like this, I try to play so smart where I, I don't want to throw the deep ball. Short passes, quick five, you know, five yard downs right here. And you see right here, the man's wide open, gets a beautiful first down. And all this dude literally has to do is just milk the clock. And hopefully he can find a way right here. We almost get a pick. But, yeah, I mean, this dude literally just pound, 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 pound the rock like, like I do. Smart football. I mean, this is all you have to do. But we are literally stopping him. At the behind the line, and this man is just had to go for it. So nonetheless, we are just now. This is crunch time. Now I'm getting nervous. This is I say that when I get nervous, my and I start you know my heart's starting to race. Cause I'm thinking you know I'm I'm focused. I'm just trying to find a way to at least you know kick a field goal and go in overtime. That's all I'm really thinking about. But usually when I get in the goal line, I you know if I do get in the goal line, I try to just go for the touchdown. Even though I mean. I mean, that's what you're playing. You're almost, if you're almost there, you're almost there. But you see right here, I am moving the ball a little bit with Andre Ellington in the back for you to get in the first down. So I got a minute left. I got two timeouts. I can just try to do a little bit of hurry up, get there, call a timeout, and hopefully, you know, kick a field goal or a touchdown to win the game. But you see right here, I'm trying to find some audibles, and sometimes I'm like, you know what? I got to just go for gold. Hopefully, just go for the deep ball. But I do make some audibles here, our hot routes right here. You see Manziel looking, and he fires that man. He fires Ogantry, and then I get the first. Old tree? Og tree? Two chains, whatever. I just <laughs> let's see right here. I do get the first, you know, first down, run out of bounds, and try to do a little bit of hurry ups. But I, at this point, when I realize, look at this video, I gotta relax and calm down. I have time. I do have two timeouts. At this point, I'm just like, I gotta, I gotta get in the end zone. I gotta find a way to just, just gotta get in the end zone. So. I'm <laughs> just panicking at the moment right here. You see Andre Ellington breaking a couple tackles here and gets the first down. So I'm thinking, hey, we we can we can win this game. We got to. As you see right here, another spin move breaks a tackle. Another spin move, and I'm thinking, oh my god, if I went to the other side, that would have been perfect. But as you see right here, I took my points and we're sending this bad boy to overtime. I'm super stoked, super radical that we're finally going to overtime. But I'm thinking, listen. Play smart football. Don't don't let anything a stupid, you know, some Madden cheese, you know, play smart football. You see right here, we almost get the pick. That would have been game over. Pick six to the crib. But I mean, I mean that ain't gonna happen. I mean, come on. But look at look at your boy though. I am playing phenomenal D. And look at that son. Nothing. Get that out of here, you bum. <laughs> That's disrespectful. I ain't going to call him bum. But you see right here, once again, I am, you know, pound, 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 pound. First down, first down, first down. But you see right here, I'm now it's fourth and three. You know, those last two plays weren't doing, you know, doing well for me. So, you know, I got to pass the rock. I got to I gotta find a way to get a first down here. So, Manziel's draw back, fires, and he sees his man. And, oh, my God, I thought he fumbled right there. I was so, so damn nervous. But right here, we hand the ball off to Andre Ellington. He breaks a tackle. This man is going, this is going to the crib. This game's a wrap, son. This game's a wrap. Week two's in the books. 2-0. Your boy takes it. Oh my god, I'm I'm, I'm too hyped right now, man. That's game over, boy. I hope you guys enjoyed this. This is a pretty good ass game, I ain't gonna lie. But you see that Manzel 
is wrong. Eagles Manziel is right. We didn't really even, like, <laughs> bro, it was a good game. <laughs> but I'm, I'm too high right now, I'm sorry. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video, so like, comment, subscribe, and I'm out. Peace. 2-0, and oh, man. I gotta tell my mom. Definitely, definitely gotta tell my mom. She's gonna be super stoked. Oh, she's gonna be super stoked.